94. Welcome to the action here at Barnsley Metrodome. Quarter final stage now. Ricky Evans against Chris Dobie. Maybe not the quarter final we were expecting to see. Chris Dobie was expecting to see it. He, as he hits a 177, he took to social media last night to say he had fallen at the last 16 stage again yesterday, but would break that duck today. And he's proved to be a man of his word. Hollywood, Chris Dobie. But Rapid Ricky is on the rampage as well. 96. Doby wants 90 for the first leg. Treble 18 for the double in the same segment of the board. 54. Doesn't land it, but Evans is way back on 205. 96. Game shot. And Doby takes the first leg. Both these players 26 years old. 59. A glimpse into the future, perhaps. Although that's only a year younger than Michael Van Gerwen. And he is certainly the present. Will he be getting another 100. present of £10,000 today? He's in the quarterfinals as well, playing Berry Van Pier. Dan Dawson is commentating on that one over on Showboard 2. I'm Chris Murphy here on Showboard 1. Live stream darts from the PDC. One of these players will be reaching the last four. That will be new. Well, this is new territory for Chris Dober. Rick Evans has made a semi-final once before, back in 2013, at this very venue in Barnsley. On that occasion, he was beaten by Jamie Robinson. And there's a max from Dober. A player from the Gary Anderson stable of darts, the world champ, is his mentor, along with Michael Smith and Adam Hunt. 53. Certainly knows how to pick them. 81. And he's looking at 68, Chris Dobie, for a two leg cushion. Double 16. And he gets it. Good start from Chris. Now, if one of these players were to get to the final or perhaps even win the tournament, there is still an outside chance of a World Grand Prix spot. There's a game going on in the last 16 at the moment between Christo Reyes and Mickey Mansell. And whoever wins that game will move into a spot for the World Grand Prix, but through different rankings. 91. Mickey Mansell would leapfrog Mick McGowan to take the second Irish qualifying spot. Christo Reyes would leapfrog Josh Payne to be one of the 14 Pro Tour qualifiers. But that could change if he doesn't then go on to reach a final. Because Steve West, Ricky Evans, even Chris Dobie could overtake him. So interesting stuff. We know that Justin Pipe, Jermaine Watamina and Mark Webster have all missed out on spots in the WGP. And now Dobe wants 58 for three nil. Oh, is a slip into the four? Will it matter? It's one die at double instead of two. And it may matter a lot. Evans, 76 needed, 16. For double top, 56. but he's missed. Reprieve for Dobie. He'll return for the highest double on the board. Now down to double 10. Oh, and it's got inside. 
And Evans gets a chance to break and half the deficit. Same target. Game shot. 2 1. Just a reminder that there's been five nine dart legs in two days here in Barnsley. Three of them today. Michael Van Gerwen, Simon Whitlock and Jordi Muvisa. All striking perfection. MVG hit one yesterday as did Jeffrey de Graaf. Twenty four nine darters hit on the PDC two this year. The record was last year when there was twenty nine hits, so I'm sure that will go. Only three have been broadcast live. Gary Anderson at the World Championship. Michael Van Gerwen in the UK Open. And Adrian Lewis at the Premier League in Belfast. This is a good response from Chris Dobie to being broken in the last leg. He's left 70. A little bit of pressure, but doesn't have to hit a treble in this combo. Double 16. 38. Well, we've seen Ricky do this before. Oh, another one of those for double six. Oh, and look a rapid Ricky Evans just on the wire of the double six. And Doby finds the required target and restores a two leg advantage. So to get to this stage today, Chris Dobie took out Alan Norris in his first match, a seeded opponent. Then he did for James Richardson and the pieman Andy Smith as Evans rattles in a maximum. After that, he defeated Devon Peterson. And that put him in this position of a first pro to a quarter-final. Not his first quarter-final. He's made a last eight placing on the European Tour before now. Twenty six year old from Bedlington. Sixty. Uh, One fifty, a bit of a Hollywood shot for the man who calls himself Hollywood. But Evans breaks back again. 48 check out. Back on throwing this one. Twenty-four. And the winner will face either Steve West or the winner of that match that I mentioned between Mickey Mansell and Christo Reyes. So there could be 60. a little bit of a wait. Whoever wins this match to play the semi-final. Michael Van Gogh and Barry Van Peer playing a quarter final at the moment. Kim Hybrecht is also through. And Steve West through thanks to a 6 2 victory against 
Simon Whitlock. 100. I'm just getting news that Christo Reyes has defeated Mickey Mansell. So Reyes now moves into a provisional qualifying spot for the World Grand Prix. 100. That means Payne for Josh Payne. He will miss out. Having won a Pro Tour event this year, Josh Payne will not qualify for the World Grand Prix. We already know that Justin Pipe is out of the reckoning. But the way this bottom half of the draw has opened up, it's not quite over yet. Christo Reyes may indeed have to carry on and reach the final just as a sort of spoiler to stop anyone else from grabbing maximum prize money and pipping him to the post. And Evans, in this match, wants 88 to level it up. And he's got a shot, a double seven, and he's taken it out. And so quick, that switch. That's why they call him Rapid. Three, three. Yeah, just a touch again on that match between Reyes and Mansell that has, for now, put Reyes into the World Grand Prix places. 180. It's also confirmed Mick McGowan's place because Mansell couldn't overtake him in the Irish qualifying stakes. So that semi-final run a couple of days ago has put Mick Gowan into the World Grand Prix. 145. Game shot. So four three to Chris Derby now, but Evans responds with one eight. He's followed it up. Six perfect darts from Ricky Evans. We've had five, nine darters in two days here in Barnsley. 60. Will Ricky Evans treat us to one on a live stream? He might, you know. He just might, you know. Oh, he's missed the double 12. Ricky Evans misses double 12 for a nine dart leg. It would have been the fourth of the day. What an effort from Evans. To be fair, the double 12 was not really close. But all he want to do is finish a job. Down of double three. Does finish a job. 11 data in the end for all. That's the closest we've come on the live stream to perfection. And would it have been the quickest nine data? And he's off 180 again in the next leg, Ricky Evans. Fifty-seven. Right, well, Ricky Evans missed double 12 in the last leg. Oh, he's not set it up this time. Five perfect darts from Ricky Evans. He has found some kind of... Van Gerwen esque vortex, and he's just playing darts from the gods over the last couple of legs in the treble again and again. This is some surge from Ricky Evans, and will it take him to the semi finals? Game shot. Game shot again for Evans, and a break of throw. And he is now throwing for a place in the last four of PC 16 here in Barnsley. 
So can Dobie stem the tide and take us to a last leg decider? You might need to take out 126 one, two, to do it. Evans poised on 65. Doby needs a treble 19 with this dart for a shot at the bullseye for five all. 101. And he's just missed it. Evans wants 65. Now he wants tops. Ricky Evans is through to the semi-finals of Players' Championship 16 here in Barnsley. It's going to be a bit of a wait to find out who he will face. 